The cosmic microwave background is polarized, which means that the light coming from it has an orientation and a direction that we can measure. This is the same as what you see by looking at me through this polarizing filter. Before the Big Bang era, during cosmic inflation, gravitational waves would have rippled through the universe and le left an imprint on the cosmic microwave background. We call these primordial gravitational waves, or B modes. They produce a spiral pattern in the CMB. Lightbird is an experiment for measuring these primordial gravitational waves, which would give mankind a test of cosmic inflation and our understanding of the creation of the universe. Uh, Lightbird is a space mission with three telescopes which will launch in the late 2020s and will orbit at the second Earth-Sun Lagrange point about a million miles from Earth in the opposite direction of the Sun because this makes it easier for Lightbird to avoid imaging these bright objects as it scans the whole sky. All three telescopes are cooled to 100 millikelvin, minus 273.05 centigrade, only 0 0.1 degrees above absolute zero. This is important because the telescopes are equipped with transition edge sensors, which become nearly superconductive at this temperature. This lowers their noise and also allows Lightbird to be more sensitive to the tiny, tiny signal of B modes. Lightbird uses a half wave plate which rotates on superconducting magnetic bearings, which modulates the polarization of the incoming light and also allows us to reduce some systematic effects. Its 4,800 detectors will allow us to measure the polarization of the CMB and hopefully the primordial gravitational waves. Stay tuned with Kavli IPMU to hear more about the Lightbird Telescope and our efforts for the future. Bye bye from our lab at Kavli IPMU.